Hello, it's time for another meal. So I am going to show you today how I make a meal using my containers. So <clears throat> I have a piece of low sodium sprouted bread and this acts as my one yellow container. <clears throat> Excuse me, so again, it's low sodium sprouted bread, one yellow container, that goes down. Next up, I'm going to put some arugula. Now as long as you can put the lid on, that is okay to pack it full. So I'm going to put a little bit of arugula and keep some on the side. So there's my arugula and I will add it as I want to as I'm eating it. Next up, I'm going to put one red container. So two hard boiled eggs acts as one red container. So I pre hard boiled these over on my um, meal prep day on Sunday and now they're ready to go. So I'm going to put that on top and I'm going to slice up the second one and put it right on top. And that again is my one red container. So next up, I'm going to do a teaspoon and my teaspoon today is going to be olive oil. So I'm going to pour in about a teaspoon into this little spoon and I'm going to drizzle it on top. And that's going to be my teaspoon. So next up, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a couple of little spices on there, maybe a little bit of um, pink Himalayan salt and that's all, that's my meal. And so I know that I have now consumed, after I eat this one green, one, oh, yikes, one red and one yellow, and then also one teaspoon. So my meal consists of a green, a red, a yellow, and a teaspoon. And that's how I would count my containers for 80 day obsession or for 21 day fix or for whatever meal plan you're using. Um, this one acts as a post-workout meal for me because it's exactly what it's called for in my post-workout meal. Have a good day, everybody.